97.9 GRD rocks. Hey, it's Jana. And I have a very special guest, John from Skillet. What is up, man? Hey, how's it going? <laughs> I'm so well. You guys just did an amazing acoustic performance here. Oh, for thank you. Listeners. Thank you for being here. I was telling you beforehand, I was like, ah, every time we do this, I get chills. I just do because <laughs> it, it's so awesome to be that close to you guys while you're doing something amazing well, that I can't you. do, putting on an awesome performance yes. pretty early in the day for some. Very early in the day. And I'm not sure it was chill worthy, but it was fun. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it, it was awesome. So we've got a show coming up uh, on yes. the 20th at Soaring Eagle. But then right here in Grand Rapids, show is August 6th or not August October. It's August today, which is yeah, why I'm confused. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, honestly, <laughs> it's October 6th. <laughs> Skelly, you're going to be at theater section. Yes, that's correct. That's correct. It was a uh, late ad. I'm really excited we're coming because it's one of our favorite cities to play in. So it was uh, good to be finally touring. So excited to be touring again. It's going to be great. Yeah, no, we're, we're happy to have you back. You're going to be with Sick Puppies. And they were here just a couple weeks ago. So. Yeah, that's what I heard. Yeah, they're great people. Be good. Yeah, good, good people, good band. It's going to be a great tour. It's our first headlining run we've done in like four years because we've been doing, you know, there's so many package tours that happen now, which are also cool, but I've been really dying to to do headlining runs in America. Uh, I take that back. We've been doing headlining runs, but not in the U.S. We basically, we go to Europe and we do uh, to headline tours and we do Russia headline, uh, South America, and then we come back to America and we end up doing another package tour. We never get to play, you know, the full set and the back catalog and so going to a smaller room and uh, getting to pack the people in, I'm really pumped about it. Awesome. So we can absolutely look forward to that and look forward to your new album all this week. Right? Yes, all, all five Friday. days. Uh, Unleashed. Woo. Unleashed. I'm so excited about it. Yeah, you know, doing a record, it's like, you feel like you're having a baby. It takes so long for this thing to finally get released, even when it's finally done and, and mastered. And then it, they, you know, it's three more months or something and so much... Uh, promo and so much pressure and it just feels good to finally have it out yeah well can you tell us about the new album you know how it came to be the uh, inspiration behind it you know you know this is our 10th record so it's a. Uh, I mean I love writing music I, I always feel inspired to write because I <laughs> because I'm alive <laughs> and I feel and uh, I like writing things I feel you know things that I'm going through in my life um, but uh, Sometimes when you record a record, it, it can actually become stifling. You, you you wrote songs you're excited about. You turn them in. The label says, you know, you know, yes, but no thanks. You know, not good enough. Keep writing. And then you keep writing. And by the end of it, it just wasn't fun. And I will say this record was extremely fun. We wrote a bunch of songs, had a great time, and just kind of recorded what we wanted to record and worked with some uh, really great producers. And uh, my first time working with a guy called Kevin Churko. He produced... Uh, the five finger records and, uh, the newest Papa Roach. And, uh, he's just awesome in this moment and Ozzy. And so, uh, we got to do a couple songs together. It was my first time working with him, which was great. And then I worked with our producer, Brian house, who produced our comatose record about 10 years ago. So, uh, it was fun. Yeah. And it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a good record. Very good workout album, you know, energetic, <laughs> yeah. nice to work out to. Yeah. Well, very cool. Well, again, Skelet, we're so glad that you guys are here today. The new album Unleashed comes out on Friday. And we've been rocking your new song, uh, "Feel Invincible," which we're gonna we're gonna play right now. Would you do me the honor? Do all of us the honor? Will you intro it? <laughs> I for will. Me? I'd love to, man. Let's see. Feel invincible. Uh, this song I wrote. It's kind of a fight song. It's a song that needs to be played at the Super Bowl, and I hope someone's <laughs> listening and makes that happen. But uh, it's a fight song to keep going, even though we're living in a crazy world. That you find something worth living for and worth waking up for tomorrow morning, and don't give up. So anyway, this is John with Skillet. You're about to hear our song, "Feel Invincible." <laughs> 